ahead and graph this. Um, trust me, I am not going to expect you guys to draw circles because my circles are bad enough. You guys can only imagine when I ask you guys to do circles what those quizzes look like. I made that mistake once and I will never do it again. So I will provide you with polar graph paper if I do ask you to graph. Obviously, we're going to have two rings here. So we're going to go to the outer ring two. And then we just need to apply it for the angle 5 pi over 6 in standard form, which is going to be right there, roughly. Right? Yeah. OK. Because obviously, you could draw like the angle here, pi over 6, stuff like that. But that would be your coordinate point. The next thing is I ask you to convert. So again, we want to convert this to x and y's. So x equals r times cosine of theta, and y equals r times sine of theta. Well, we have r, 2, and cosine is um, of cosine of 5 pi over 6. And r is 2 times the sine of 5 pi. So 5 pi over 6 is going to be in the second quadrant, so it's negative square root of 3 over 2. And then y is positive 1 half. So it looks like I'm getting a coordinate point negative square root of 3, comma 1. So this is radians? What do you mean? Everything is in radians. What are you typing in your calculator? Oh, if you want to type that into your calculator? Uh, I mean, no, like, do you have to switch from degrees to radian? Or? If you're going to use your calculator, yes. But I was hoping that you guys would know your unit circle. You wouldn't need to use your calculator for that. But if you do want to check your answer with your calculator, yes, you've got to make sure your, your angle is in radian mode. So you've got to change your calculator back to radians. Okay. And so that, can, that causes a problem with this test, because students will do a one problem in radians then do the next problem in degrees and forget to change it in their calculator. So yes, you do have to be very careful with this chapter. Make sure you always check what you're dealing with is in degrees or in radians.